It is a Saturday, and yeah, I absolutely took an L on the uh, Jordan 1 Japan Midnight Navy like I knew I would, and there's not really a whole lot of feeling about it, because I know I knew what it was. I knew the game, uh, which is fine. Move on to the next sneaker. Or for me, more so the Fear of God drops because more news actually has leaked. So do yourself a favor. Go follow the page I told you to follow. Uh, in my last video talking about the Nike and Fear of God basketball collaboration for 2020 that drops next week. And then he also has his regular essentials drops. But for today, yes, I picked up four pairs of sneakers for under $70. Now, two of them were not for me. It was a hookup for an amazing friend uh, for her kids. But I picked up two for myself and I actually got a birthday gift uh, from one of my awesome coworkers. So let's unbox that. Let's look at the kicks. And you know, hopefully your Saturday's going well. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see. Yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and I won. What's up everybody? It's your girl TJ back with another video talks with TJ, aka TJ Two Shoes Chance. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. When you are viewing this, it is a Saturday and I'm definitely gonna try to get this out for you guys on a Saturday. No, I don't have like the hype sneaker to be able to show you like, oh my God, I got the Jordan 1 and what do you guys think? And these are the materials and that's also the video you've seen like everywhere. Uh, I don't have that. So yeah, I don't have it. If you hit, awesome, <laughs> like uh, bravo for you. I had to take a break from what I was doing because I was actually getting content for another video that I need to drop for you guys on Monday since Tuesday and Wednesday's videos are already done. But uh, I took that L and I simply got ready for work and went to work, walked in and we had amazing sales. First off, we had shoes in that we never really get in and then they were deep discounted already and then I got my discount. So that's what we'll get into. But first, thank you to my coworker, E, you're amazing. Uh, she put Starburst on the outside for me, but she makes like this it's a homemade like vanilla sugar scrub, I believe. And so she gave me this big old jar. Y'all know, listen, it's, it's that fall. Like I love fall. I love it. But you know, you got to make sure you take care of your skin. You got to moisturize. You got to keep it exfoliated. So I cannot wait to use this after a nice long hot shower. Um, e, very much so appreciate it. And so the kicks, listen, it's nothing crazy, all right? You, you guys see, right? Like a sneaker life hoodie, which yes, it's like buy a sneaker life, AKA Mike Compass, AKA Mike Mitchell. Um, I like all types of sneakers. Certainly I've branched out in the last few years, uh, whether it's New Balance, whether it's Vans, I've always had Iversons in the past, so that's nothing really new. But this time around, it's me branching out into, uh, truthfully, into that skater brand a little bit more. So, there were Vans on sale, I kid you not, for $19.99 and $29.99. And they were in my size at work. And I had to grab them. So, this is actually the Vans era. So, it is another low-profile shoe by Vans. So, it's not the authentic, right? The era, at least to me, tends to be a little bit more um, reinforced in terms of the cuff on the actual ankle here. The interior does have, you know, that, that leather on the inside. And then uh, the play on materials is always a little bit different. So with this, it actually has a leather toe box instead of the traditional canvas. Now there is canvas all along the rest of it, but then you also have off the, that goes around the entire midsole of the shoe. And instead of that little bitty off the wall that's usually on the back, I'm about to expose the other sneaker that's usually on the back. It has a massive off the wall um, Vans tag on the back. So I picked these up. So let me look at the, the actual name just to make sure I get it right for you guys. Um, it is Checkerboard Disarray um, Black White, okay? Size six, so these are normally $65 and again for all four of these I only I ended up paying less than 70 I paid $67 total for all of these now of course I was able to use my discount so I have these now I decided to do a lace swap actually because they come with these they come with um they come with another pair of laces actually I don't oh they actually come with these laces too sorry about that so they actually have these laces, which are just black and white checkered. So I thought about throwing those in there, but instead I went a little more bold and I put the red ones in. So they are red and they say Vans 
um, repeat all the way over in this awesome band's pattern. Uh, so you guys, please make sure you comment down below. Which one would you keep in, right? Would you just keep the white uh, laces in? Would you do the red? I am not really sure which I'm going to do, but I, I might just keep it uh, mixed because I've done that for a minute now with a lot of my sneakers, um, especially like all my fear got. But again, I love the fact that the toe box is leather and uh, instead of that canvas, because you do get a little caught, you're a little cautious when it comes to the canvas, right? You're going to have to clean it a lot if it gets dirty. Um, now you're probably like, TJ, didn't you just buy other checkerboard vans? I did, but you can't have enough, okay? And for the price that I paid for these, um, less than like, what, $20 a pair, I think I'm okay. So this is the other pair that I picked up. So this is actually considered like the tri-color checkerboard. So again, you have yellow, you have red, and then you have blue on the upper of the shoe. It's just the blue along the midsole, the stripe there. And then it's the smaller uh, off the wall tag. On the back, again, these are nothing crazy, but I like getting shoes simply that I like and at amazing prices. So that's what I was able to do today as soon as I walked into work. Well, I should say as I clocked out of work, but I put these aside, picked these up, and we actually had these in the sizes for um, one of my best friends and my stylist. So I went ahead and made sure to pick up her um, her daughter and her niece a pair so that way they are set. They can throw these on, go to school. Uh, you know, it, it's always nice to make sure the kids are hooked up, right? So we got that traditional, um, that gum waffle on the bottom. But yeah, it almost does feel like these are three separate shoes only because the laces can change so much on these. At least I think that it can. But you guys can certainly go ahead and comment uh, below which is your favorite like I, I have mixed reviews from friends honestly some said they didn't like this some said they didn't like this some said they love this some said they love this and some just said they didn't think they could pull this off but they thought I could pull it off now this isn't a video where there's gonna be like a lookbook or anything uh, if I rock these or not if when I decide to rock these I'll certainly get some pictures probably on my Instagram at talks.with.tj so you guys can make sure that you're following me there um again just with me, what I'm waiting for, so I do still have items coming in. I have some from Nike. I have two things from Nike. Uh, the Fear of God drops will determine a lot. I'm not going to lie. Like, it's my birthday week next week. It's going to determine a lot <laughs> in terms of money spent because uh, Sneakers app is one of the places where you can buy, like, the basketball collaboration. But my sole focus will be on the actual like the uh heather or the weathered black but it's technically brown that they're dropping on the 18th on fear of god's website so i'll be focused on that hyper focused on that and then whatever i don't get there i'll try for um uh, i guess sneaker scents and some other places whoever will have it and then if i take all of those l's uh, i'm just gonna head to nike and buy some stuff and save the rest of the money that's probably gonna be it and i am anticipating some l's i'll be real with you all right but just nothing crazy on this Saturday. Uh, it's crappy weather out now, so I'll probably chill out for the rest of the evening. As always, extra age, not your shoe size. Peace out. Peace out.